forget about varicose veins with these three natural remedies. How often do you think about the back of your lids? After all, it's hard to see, which is why it isn't uncommon to suddenly notice that you have the treaded varicose veins. It can even happen to the front side of your legs. Have you taken a look recently? Most of us don't pay too much attention to our body, especially on busy days. If you've noticed that your varicose veins are becoming a problem, forget about them with these natural remedies. What are varicose veins? Before talking about our natural remedies that you can use for varicose veins, it's important to know that varicose veins are dilated blood vessels that are usually red or blue in color. They can appear in a very small area as well in large ones. Because of their appearance, they're also known as spider veins. They most often appear along the sides of the legs and calves. You might also find a few on your face. Normally, you won't experience any symptoms and they usually aren't detrimental for your health. However, if they're very big or too numerous, you might experience an itching and burning sensation. What causes varicose veins? Whether varicose veins appear or not depends a great deal on your genetics, but you can take some measures to reduce your chances of getting them. The factors that you should control are Being overweight and not getting enough of exercise. Obesity. Taking oral anti-contraceptives. History of blood clotting. Wearing clothes that are too tight. Blood circulation problems. Keeping these in mind, we're sure that you already have some general ideas about natural remedies to use for varicose veins. But just in case, here are some of our recommendations. 1. Do low intensity exercises that improve circulation in your legs. Maintaining an adequate blood circulation in your legs with easy exercises is the first and simplest of the natural remedies for treating varicose veins and random bruising. Exercise with low intensity workouts. If you don't know where to start, try the following. Walk your dog in the morning and once more in the afternoon. Get on an exercise bike for 25 minutes each day. Do house chores that require you to walk. Go up and down stairs in the morning and at night. In addition to preventing varicose veins, these exercises will help you stay healthy for many years. 2, comma, try wearing compression tights. The second natural remedy for saying goodbye to varicose veins is perfect if they've already become a visible problem. Compression tights improve your circulation because they maintain the natural shape of legs and give them support. You can find them with high, low and medium compression in any big supermarket. When choosing your size, consider the following. Low compression. Low compression tights are ideal for you if your veins are very small and few. 
They're very similar to the normal commercial pair of tights. You can put them on for just a couple hours or for the entire day, depending on what makes you comfortable. Medium compression. You should use these kinds of tights if your varicose veins aren't too big but are visible without a simple glance. Put them on for at least 6 hours, especially when you're on your feet for a long time or aren't doing too much physical activity. Eye compression. Eye compression tights are for when you have very noticeable varicose veins as well as some random bruising. Try putting them on for as long as you can during the day. You might feel a bit uncomfortable the first days, especially if you're using the high compression tights. If you want, you can start using them for a couple hours in the beginning and increase the time that you wear them each week until you feel comfortable. You don't need a prescription to buy these tights and you can wash them as you would any other pair of tights. And wash them with a gentle soap. They're slightly more expensive than normal tights, but they're meant to last longer so they're quite worth it. If you don't want to buy the tights but want the same effect, try wrapping your legs. This method isn't as practical or comfortable, but it's cheaper. 3, Elevate your legs from time to time. Another way to activate blood circulation in your legs is by elevating them for a few minutes. To elevate them, you can. Lay down on your bed and put your legs up against a wall or on two or three pillows. Recline on an armchair and put your legs up on the armrests. Sit down on the floor and put your feet up on the seat of a chair. You should keep your legs in that position for a maximum of 20 minutes and after, slowly lower your legs so as to not hurt yourself. You should never sleep the entire night in this position because when lowering your legs, you might experience pain when the blood circulates down into your legs. Try this exercise at least once a day. Ideally, you should do it three times a day if you have large varicose veins. What do you think about these natural remedies? Put them into practice and your legs will be looking good without any complications.